My name's Robin. I'm currently in a nursing home in southeast Ohio. For the past 16, 17 years, with the assistance of an aide and nurses, I've been able to stay home and stay pretty independent. I didn't need a whole lot of help with anything. If you stay in a nursing home more than three months, Medicare and Medicaid stop paying their part, and then that, so that falls on you. Since I've been in there for a certain amount of time, the nursing home takes my income, which in my case is my Social Security, and uh, they allow you $50 a month to live on. And you can't make a house payment on $50. So after three months, they foreclose on my house. I had my house built by uh, Habitat. The house is built around me. I kind of designed the house the way I wanted it, how it would work for me. That's what allows me to be so independent at home. But if I lose this house, there's a shortage on accessible homing, and it would just make it that much harder to be able to get out of the nursing home. In 2004, I had a car accident. I hydroplaned and it wound up paralyzing me. Last year I broke my femur and my hip, I, I fell. So I wound up in the nursing home and I was there for three months and they set me up for assistance for when I got home, whenever I left. And then whenever I got home, I was refused those services. So I wound up back into another nursing home, which is where I'm at now someone has the resources to assist me until I do get aides and nurses become available. It would be so appreciated because I don't want, I don't want to lose my home. I've had so many things in my life that I have been trials. I've just kind of learned to just hope. I just hold on to the to the hope that this too shall pass.